Greetings and salutations, folks. This is Lord Ryan here, and today we're here for more Trails of Cold Steel 2. Last time, we didn't do much catch up. We basically got out of the night. Well, we escaped the horrible thing happening at the school. A month has passed. We apparently were hibernating, and we got to the town that Reen's at. So, and we're trying to gather information, say hello to everybody, you know. Humans, human things, stuff like that. Hey, normal. If you've, if you've come, come to thank, thank me for saving, saving your butt again, again save it. I'm just I'm glad, glad I made it in time. time. Princess Alphen and, and that sister of yours are the ones you should be talking to. You were on their minds this whole time. Yeah, I can tell. I really do appreciate you coming for me, though. I was pretty far out from town, so I didn't think anyone would find me. Just goes to show what bracers can do, I guess. About that, I wasn't actually the one who found you. Hmm? You weren't? Two days ago, I got a call out of nowhere on my Arcus. They gave me this crazy amount of detail on exactly where to find you, and they just hung up. Didn't even say who they were. I figured it couldn't hurt to go take a look. And sure enough, there you were. Hmm. That's strange. Wish I could tell you. I couldn't even recognize their voice. Hmm. Nah, that's not really true. It was kind of familiar. Maybe. Eh, whatever. No use dwelling on it. Right now we've got bigger problems to tackle than mystery call-offs. There's the war for starters. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Have you and the rest of the guild been doing much? Well, we've been trying. We're pretty limited on what we can do. Partly because we've all been split up since the war broke out. I don't even know if any of the others in Erebonia are okay. Sarah included. It sounds like things have gotten even more serious since I was away. Sure has. Not even regular civilians have been able to escape being affected by it. As it stands, the Noble Alliance has the overwhelming advantage. Because they got mechs. We should get mechs of our own. But the Imperial Army is showing no signs of surrendering to them. Particularly in a few regions across the country. see. Oh, and another thing you might hear. We've been getting reports of a few Jaeger Corps taking part in the war too. Even members of Ouroboros. The Blong? Want to be fan thief? Ouroboros? That's secret, that's secret society? society? That's, that's the one. one. Jaegers, Jaegers being, being employed here in Erebonia is nothing new, new but there's way, way more, more of them here these days. days. As, As for Ouroboros, Ouroboros they're, probably they're probably just trying, trying to stir up trouble of their own. Mm. It's, what it's what they do they best. best. Then there's the fact that Erebonia isn't the only place with problems right now. Crossbell's full of them too. There's so much to freak out about these days, it could drive you insane. Sorry, you've, you've got, got enough on your play play without, without me dumping, dumping all this on you. I'll try saving all those bad thoughts you got piling up for another day, okay? You, you need, need to focus, focus on relaxing. You can decide, you can decide what you want to do after that. that. Um, sure. sure. Thanks, Toval. You're probably right. You're just a fountain of good advice, huh? <laughs> I've just got a few years worth of life experience on you, that's all. Oh, and while I'm giving you good advice, why not, Why not take, take a dip, a dip in, the in the hot springs? springs. Uh-oh. Could be a nice way to clear your head. <laughs> it probably would. Hasn't let me down before. Maybe I should pay a visit to the Phoenix Wings later. I smell fan service in the future. Alright, uh, where am I going here? Okay, so where am I going to Okay, so there's a tavern, there's inn, church. There's two exits out of town. I also notice I can't move the camera anymore with the map, so this area is fixed. Uh, there was something in the mansion I missed. There is church. All right. Oh. Oh, there, there we go. This is the map I was looking for. Not okay. So there's one down below, and then one here. Okay. Mala. Mother! I wonder if she's gonna be okay if I bring in Fee, who's gonna be like the future sister, future daughter-in-law. Like, hey, here you go, I got your future daughter-in-law. 
Baja. Geralt. Oh, damn. Well, I guess in a month's, month's notice, they did probably did a Blitzkrieg with those freaking knights, because those knights pretty much one shot the tanks. It's like the Federation versus Zeon at the very first part of the war. The Zeon were dominating at one point. And then all things went to hell. Sorry, I don't, didn't mean to give you the Gundam history, though, but yeah. That's joking aside, we should really develop our own knights, but... Oh, hey! He is now a captain now! Okay, can jump to this house. Well, he is captain of an airship, so I doubt he'd be in danger, I think. Uh, so, Legram is... Okay. Will we ever actually meet Master Young Kadfai? I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. I can't, I can't even teleport. I can't even teleport anymore. I can't teleport! Oh. There's something here? Whee! Who this? Is this the same fishing lead we saw in the first game? Yeah! It's the one chick who lost her wallet and she started fishing, right? Been, this might be Keith's girlfriend, I guess. Or oh, rivals. Yay, we get to learn how to fish again. Which I heavily recommend don't doing in this turbo spot mode. Looks perfect for fishing. Because turbo mode makes fishing game hell. <laughs> I'll leave it at that. Okay, so where else am I going? Ymir Chapel and Spring. Let's go save the fan service for last because I'm pretty sure something horrible, horrible will happen. Who knows? Elephant. Uh. She's praying so intently. Thinking about it, she must be even more distressed right now than I am. Oh, she has two brothers. So. Why, hello, Reed! <laughs> You're looking rather well today. Much better than you were yesterday, at any rate. I feel loads better, actually. How about you? Are you managing all right here? If there's anything I can do to make things easier for you, though, don't hesitate to let me know. You keep slipping on the freaking button here. Oh, not at all! I've been simply loving my stay here. The scenery is stunning. The hot springs are all so soothing, to say nothing of your mother's spectacular cookie cream. I'm having the time of my life here. I almost envy Elise for growing up in such a wonderful place. It must be freezing too, because that's snow. <laughs> I'm happy to hear you say that, still. On top of all that, I was able to reunite with you here. Uh-oh. Oh, and meet a mysterious talking cat too. Not everyone gets to do that now, do they? I still haven't had the pleasure of meeting that ashen knight of yours, however. Perhaps I might have the chance once he wakes up? <laughs> I suppose I can dream. Um, well... Well, she's the first person to actually question questions about the talking cat. What? <laughs> uh... I realize I'm the last person who has any right to say this, but there's no need to force yourself to bottle everything up and put on a brave face. I know how worried I am about my classmates, so I can only imagine how you must feel. I... Uh oh. I'm so sorry. I'm supposed to be royalty. I shouldn't be getting all worked up about something like this, but I. Uh, uh oh. Just thinking of what my family must be going through is just too much to bear. Cedric and I. We had a fight on the morning it all happened. I was planning to make up with him that evening, but I. 
Sorry. I'm sure he won't hold that against you. You'll be able to make up with him next time you see him. I'm sure that'll be sooner than you think, too. In the meantime, there's no need to force yourself to seem like being apart from him isn't bothering you. Royalty or not, no one would blame you for being worried or upset, and every single one of us here wants to do what we can to help you. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I wonder if Lisa would, like, I'm fine now. go yonder, eh? I, I hope I don't sound ungrateful, but... I think, I think you should, should be spending, spending more time, time with Elise, with Elise rather, rather than me. This is your first chance in a while to spend some quality time together. I'd hate to take that away from her. Why? <laughs> I mean, it's true that she's a little more dependent on me than you'd expect for a girl her age. But that doesn't mean she needs me hovering around her all the time. Then again, she did seem more shaken up than usual. Maybe you're right. I should try and cheer her up while I still can. Th that's not exactly what I meant. This is so, so difficult, difficult on a fair maiden's heart. I hope you know. You're just making me wish you were my brother all the more. <laughs> Why? Cause Reen is that popular? I don't know. I'm starting to see a little bit of Persona 4 here where everybody likes the main character for some reason. Never fully explained. Alright, fan service time. Oh, oh, wrong button. Chef! stuff I cooked is gone. Now I, I can't even throw horrible, horrible omelets at people. And make them get poisoned or something even worse. Alright, so... Oh. Uh, we go... Who this? Who's over here? Oh. Butler! Yes, and I don't think we have any side quests at the moment. <sighs> you really can't beat an outdoor hot spring. Feels like all the fatigue that's been building up inside me is melting away. I don't think I realized just how exhausted I was until I came in here. But to be honest, if I go into a hot spring, I'd be dying. I can't handle, uh, heat, sadly. In real life. That's why I hate what summer. The... What am I supposed to do now? Chancellor Osborne's been shot? The capital's been occupied? He's been shot, but is he dead, though? See, that's my big question. Because from the ending, he's just like, Oh, yeah, well played. Don't worry, I still have a check a checkmate on my sleep here. Now even Trista and the Academy are under the Noble Alliance's control. Hmm. Then there's Krull. I was practically a joke. I didn't stand a chance against him. But what if we get more than one knight, see? Even borrowing the power of something like a divine knight wasn't enough to fight him on equal terms. Far from it. It was hopeless from the start. I didn't realize before, but he was holding back against me the whole time. Even without that trump card of his, he could have defeated me effortlessly. Let's not repeat that. Actually, fun fact, I died so many times because on the harder difficulty I accidentally put on, you have to be very precise on the input and hope to God that you do the extra attack when the dodge hits. And yet there was me, all happy, hmm. thinking that I'd won, right before he knocked me back with a single blow. If only I wasn't so weak. If only I'd been able to hold my ground. 
Maybe things would have been different. Instead, mm. I ended up running away and leaving everyone else behind. There's no point in blaming how things ended on Celine or Valimar. None of this is their fault. This is all on me. Because of that, I've lost everything. I finally found a place where I felt I belonged, and people to share it with. And I lost it all. I thought my life was finally gaining some direction, but now I feel totally lost again. Reen? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Sorry if I'm bothering you. Elise, did you want to use the springs too? Uh-oh. Um, I... I heard you were here. Uh-oh. So I thought that perhaps I could come and join you. Uh-oh. I mean, I know we used to come in here together when we were kids, but we're a little old for that now, don't you think? I'm not so sure it's the best idea. Let me, let me, let me clarify. Uh-oh! Please, we're siblings! There's no need to feel so self-conscious. I'm having horrible, 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 horrible SAO flashbacks. And you must be exhausted after all that's happened. So I thought the least I could do was come and wash your back for you. Again! Uh-oh! Again! Uh-oh! Uh-oh! This is awkward. Very, very awkward. The water's nice and toasty, huh? Truth be told, I haven't taken a dip here for some time. I'd forgotten how pleasant it was to sit here and admire the snow. Yeah, bathing during the fall when the leaves are changing has its charms, but something about watching the snow really relaxes me. And it's plenty relaxing even without a bottle of sake in hand, despite what Master Kafai might tell you. <laughs> He's always been a heavy drinker. To say nothing of the fact that Father can never turn down the opportunity to help him finish a bottle or three whenever he visits. Um... I'm sorry. You came out here because you were worried, didn't you? Uh, oh no! Not at all! That wasn't why I came here at all! It's just that... You're not the only one. It's like everyone I meet has to go out of their way for me. It's how things have been for my whole life. How everyone feels like they have to be around me. What do you mean? It happened the day Dad picked me up on that blizzard 12 years ago. It happened the day when I lost control and scared you 8 years ago. It happened the day Master Kafai cut short my years of training. It even happened only last month, when everyone risked their lives so that I, and I alone, could be saved. That's not... Looking back on my life, I've been too fortunate for my own good. All I've done is bask in the kindness of everyone I know. Giving nothing worthwhile in return. Despite the fan service, this is pretty deep. On the contrary, I've brought nothing but misfortune to them instead. Like I'm some kind of curse. I don't have uh -oh. the right to be treated kindly. I don't deserve to have others putting themselves out for me. Not when I seemingly can't do a thing to return that kindness and I'm too weak to fight for them when they need it most. They're pissing off your emoto chan here. If this should have ever happened. If I'd known it would. If I'd known things would ever become like this, then I'd never have gone to the Academy to begin with. Stop! Do you seriously mean all that you've just said? I... The right to be treated kindly? And who exactly decides who has that right, whatever that's supposed to be? Uh. I don't look out for you because I expect something in return or because I want you to defend me. Acts of kindness aren't debts to be repaid. I look out for you because I care about you. Because you're important to me! And I'm sure that Mother, Father, Master Kafai, your classmates, and all of your other acquaintances feel the same. So please, from the bottom of my heart... Please don't say that you don't have the right to be treated kindly. Of course you do. You just don't realize it. You care so much about the people who matter to you. So why can't you understand that those people care just as much about you? <gasps> Think back to that day when you were separated from your classmates. Yeah, this is starting to sound like Ruby all over again. They chose to fight for you. What kind of expressions did they have when you parted from them? They... see each other again. That no matter what happened along the way, we'd all be reunited. And that one day, 
we'd move forward together as a class again, just like we did before. In fact, moving onward before this and all that, I'm gonna just commentate in voice on most of the videos instead of just letting it go because I, I kind of found it really boring. Maybe um, there's nothing wrong with feeling lost and impatient from time to time. I believe in all of them. And if they see me as worthy of their trust, then I'd like to try and believe in myself too. We're classmates. And more than that, we're friends. So long as I keep moving forward, I'm sure that somewhere, someday, our paths will cross again. I think so too, Rain. Thanks, Elise. I feel like you gave me exactly what I needed to move forward. <laughs> you don't need to thank me. All I did was remind you of something you already knew. It was your time at the Academy that gave you what you needed. <laughs> I admit, I am a little envious of your classmates, though. <laughs> uh -oh. Still, I'm really thankful to have you in my life. I might not be the most dependable brother in the world, but I'd appreciate it if you kept looking out for me. And <laughs> while it might be a ways away, I'll keep striving to be an older brother you can be proud of. I'm always proud of you, you know? And of course I will. <laughs> I uh -oh. see all's well that ends well. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh, no. Y your Highness? And you've brought Celine, too. <sighs> Hope you don't mind us barging in. This is getting very awkward, very well, what quick. What brings you here? <laughs> I heard that you were both here from Tova. So I thought I might come along and see how everything was going. Besides, how could I pass up a chance to help cheer up Reem? And oh, what a heartwarming sight I happened to stumble upon during my humble quest. <sighs> Considering you were waiting for the perfect time to make your grand entrance, stumbling is a stretch. You were waiting? Were you listening in the whole time? <laughs> Please, have you ever known me to be so unladylike? But I see you've done a fine enough job for the both of us. Oh, the bond between siblings is truly a miraculous thing. Not only do you share an unwavering kinship, but you always have the tender embrace of skinship within reach. Oh dear. Also, I'm seeing a little bit of Bert in her, so... I'm so jealous. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate your concern, though, still. Elise is one thing, but I'm not entirely comfortable sharing the springs with you, your highness. Oh, come now, Reen. This is the bath! Ranks are stripped once our clothes are, as far as I'm concerned. That being said, may I join Elise in washing your back? As well? This would make the perfect chance for us to finally strengthen our bond as honorary siblings. Wouldn't you agree? Your highness, please! <laughs> oh, no. I think I got a good title name for this. Just a bunch of oh no's. Slowly capitalizing and being horribly done. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay? Huh? About, you know, things. I'm not exactly all that cognizant of human feelings and the like. Emma often points out as much. But thinking back, I have done some things that were probably quite insensitive in your eyes. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> What? If anything, I should be the one apologizing. I shouldn't have taken my frustrations out on you like that. Head pats. All right. Can you forgive okay. me. Forgive you? Why would I need to? Oh, I really don't get you sometimes. Roar. What was that? That sounded like. I know exactly what that was. It's the day from earlier. magic night we ran into on the way down the mountain. You did double tap. Damn it, Torval! I had a feeling Toval's art wasn't enough to finish it off, but the fact it's still active isn't the only problem. It sounds like it's coming this way. Damn it, Torval! He did double tap. He may have launched it off the cliff, but you still haven't killed it. Are we still not going to question the fact that, that Selene's talking and nobody else is going to question it besides Elise? Mm. 
Also, is it is it kind of odd you're just spilling crucial information out of the open? Elise does not like being the being the sideline character. So yeah, one well, of my associates did say that her and Toa will get more screen time, so. That explains one thing. Like, oh, we get new characters. They also get the Arcus's new house. That puzzle. Oh, because <laughs> of Oliver. All right, let's go giant slaying, night slaying, corporal Elise. Okay. Just my battle order. Mm -hmm. Covering items of food. I know. Stop it. Me know how to play game. Okay. So how are we going to do the formation here? Uh. Oh yeah, we don't we don't have the ability to do the links just yet. Okay, so Oop. that's work. Oh god, the camera. This is yes, yeah, this way. Okay. There's just something right. Ooh. Comment links, yay! That damn time. All right, we can do this. Oh, she. Okay, she's a healer. Okay, that kind of makes sense. Bring it on. Yes, I know. Stop it. Well, yes, I, Here I go. I've done this before. Oh, uh, I forgot to buy more battle skills. Huh. Here we go, it's fire. Ready to go. Oh, I'm still casting. Oh, no. Now's our chance. I'll back you up. Wait. I couldn't be more pleased with the outcome. Hmm. You're still not wise, though, but, oh. Uh. Yes, I I know how to play the game. Yes, I'm balancing is very good. Yes, crickles are good too. I like unique accessory quick caliber allows on these arts more quickly than any other characters making use of this. One. Okay, so he's a battle mage type person. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to skip forward as soon as I buy all the items I need since I need to buy more items. So I'll be right back in three, two, one.